Hi, I'm Amanda Fowler of Inspiring Inkin. Welcome to my craft room. In today's video, we're going to be looking at cling mount stamps. I'm going to be showing you how to assemble them and also sharing a great tip for storage as well. So let's turn the camera around and get started. So this is the stamp set back on your feet that we're going to be uh, working with to set it up today. Before I get started with that, I'm going to show you what I've done previously um, that might help you with existing stamps and what the end result is going to be. So this is one of my well-loved favourite stamp sets, Perennial Birthday, and it's the Stampin' Up! Clear Mount. So this is the previous style of red rubber that we had. Um, I didn't put the stickers on these, I just left them as they were and they cling great to the acrylic blocks. Now, I have just popped out all of these, these stamps and I peeled the backing off and then I know when I've, when I've been crafting, when I come to tidy up, I know that I've got three stamps missing and they just fit in like a little jigsaw easily. The bonus and the benefit of the new cling stamps is you put the stickers on, but they are so clingy. Seriously, seriously clingy. And I found that if I left the rubber on like this, I couldn't actually get underneath it to lift the rubber stamp off. Um, so... I um, was looking for a solution and I couldn't come up with one. <laughs> um, I was basically leaving my stamp sort of stuck like this onto the inside of the case. And then I saw a video by Sonia Benedetti from France and she explained how to do this. So um, a big thank you to Sonia, firstly, for sharing this with us. I am going to link to the French version just in case you prefer to uh, hear how to do this in French um, but I knew that uh, some of, of my customers would very much like to hear me explaining it too. So um, let's get on with this fabulous back on your feet stamp set. So we'll start out, so that's the, the case, you've got the stickers and the, the red rubber. I'm just gonna sit down to do this. So I'm just going to pop out all of, um, well, <laughs> I'm laughing because Kiva, my border terrier, has decided to join me in the office and her nails are making a lot of noise on, <laughs> on the wooden floor. So apologies if you can hear that. I'm just going to close the door. There we go. And so, where was I? Yes, so pop them all out. You've got a paper backing on them. And what you're going to do is turn the stickers over and you've got one side which um, is like a full sheet and one side which has little die cut pieces. So I'm going to find the, the tortoise and I'm going to peel this backing off. Now it is really, really important that you put these stickers on in the right place. Once the stickers are on, you will not get them off without breaking your stamp. Um, what will happen is the foam will sort of pull apart from the rubber, so you really don't want that. So take the time to line it up all the way over, press it down, and then when you're lifting it up, make sure you get underneath the label. There we go. So that's, that's one done. Just going to do another little one, and then I'm gonna whiz the camera for, forwards whilst I just do the rest of them, because you, you don't need to see me do all of them, but I do need to get all the stickers on so that I can show you the last magic bit. Right, so that's another one. Okay, so 
I'm going to be quiet now whilst to do the rest. Okay, so let's just get rid of all that rubbish. And there we've got all of the stamps all on this side. And you want to pop them on this side for now because we're going to be sticking this sheet onto the um, back here. So what you need to do is you need to peel the backing off. So um, have it so that the holes where you've taken the stickers out are facing you and then turn it over and you're going to peel the back off like this and then what you're going to do is position this in the case now what I try and do is I push it as far as I can over to that edge and then just kind of let it fall where it, it naturally wants to go I'm trying not to get any wrinkles in it um, so it just kind of falls down. So I'm trying to get no wrinkles in it. And there's a big wrinkle. Right, there we go. Okay, so if you remember this original one, I've got exactly the same here with the red rubber. Um, but now I've actually just got this insert. And then all you're going to do is peel off your stamps and again each time go underneath to lift them up don't pull like this pull straight up go underneath the sticker to make sure that you're not going to break your stamp that's going there that's going there two more i think there we go and there is the last one so that means it's really straightforward really easy so you know that you've got a stamp missing um, but you can easily get your finger underneath it so that you can um, access that stamp so there we go lovely fun stamp set um, I just I just love this unfortunately we often have to send um, get well cards and I just thought this was going to be a really fun way of doing that so thank you so much for joining me today if you would like to purchase any of the products that you've seen in the video today do pop over to my blog www.inspiringinkin.com and there is a shop button you can shop 24-7 if you subscribe to both my YouTube channel and my blog, you'll get lots more creative inspiration. And I hope I will see you again soon. Goodbye.